the next final that we are going to watch is uh, the Kumite individual male seniors uh, plus uh, 84 kilos and we have Zarko Arsovsky from Firum with a uh, red belt and Stefano Maniscalzo from Italy with a blue belt So in the next category, uh, plus 84 kilograms, we see uh, Shako Arzovsky from Firom fighting against Stefano Maniscalco in blue from Italy. Stefano Maniscalco is already a world champion, a very well experienced fighter, winning the European Championships a few times. Fighting time in this uh, final is again four minutes, as is this is a male final category. And right now we have three minutes and 15 seconds to go. Kalko is trying to apply a throwing technique, but Azovsky is escaping. Fighting time is 2 minutes and 20 seconds to go right now. The dominating fighter in this fight is obviously Stefano Maniscalco but he still wasn't able to score. Both fighters are trying to save some energy for the second half time of this fight. We still have uh, 1 minute and 40 seconds to go. But both fighters are fighting very carefully until now. We haven't seen too many actions. And now Asovsky counterattacked very fast and is not getting a score because only one judge voted for this technique. So it's still 0 to 0 and we have 70 seconds to go. And this final I in the category male plus 84 kilograms here in Karate 1 Paris in the famous Stade Pierre de Coubertin in the center of Paris. <laughs> now Maniscalco seems to be severely injured. It looks like a luxation of his shoulder, which is a very a very painful blessure. And the doctor immediately tries to f fix the shoulder. but that probably was the end of the fight as he can't get it back
uh, we have seen the slow motion of this um, painful action where Maniscalco looks at it, his shoulder. And the uh, doctor forbids him to continue the fight, although Maniscalco wanted to. Maniscalco really wanted to finish this fight. He said he could fight with one hand. <laughs> but, of course, the doctor said that's not allowed. <laughs> that is too dangerous. But that guy seems to be really tough.